Bahasim, Yahweh Shai, Bahasim, Rahakwadash, double honors to our teachers, the apostles and elders of Great Millstone. Peace, love, and salutations to the Hofi elect scattered throughout the four corners of the earth, teaching in truth, society, and diligence for the sake of Yahweh Bahasim, Yahweh Shai. Lord, when this lesson may be edifying and straight to the point. Yeah, hey, man, this is why we need the Lord, man. You see, hey, this is why we need Yahweh Bahasim, Yahweh Shai. This place is fucking vexing, man. You'll fuck around and lose it here in America, man. Dealing with Jake and just the simplicity of our nation, man. You see? This is why we need Yahweh Bashim outside of physician to come cut off the long disease and to restore the nation of Israel, man, in the spirit. You see, and real quick, it's Ecclesiasticus chapter 38 and verse 12. He said, Then give place to the physician, for the Lord hath created him. Let him not go from thee, for thou hast need of him. You know, and in the spirit, man, Yahweh Shai is that physician. You see? And Yahweh created him ultimately to be the savior of the nation of Israel. And we're a nation that needs saving, man. You see, he's not a savior to the whole world like the Christian church like the uh, like to present him, you know, like to present him to be, man. No, hey, Yahweh Shai, the, the, the son of the heavenly father, He's a uh, he's the savior of the nation of Israel, man. These so-called Negroes, Latinos, and Native Indians, which you the biblical Israelites, and you are people that need saving, man. You see, you are completely destroyed mentally and physically, man. You see, he say, let him not go from thee, for thou hast needed him. Yeah, and when you come across this truth, because this truth is your how was shot, man. You know, in this present life, he tell you that how the comforter was gonna come. You know, he must go take it in the book of John and he that, that the comforter was gonna come, man, real quick. You know, come back there. Where's that John? Wait, 14 and uh Yeah, in verse um verse uh, verse 16, he said, When I pray, and when I pray the Father, and he should give you another comforter. That he may abide with you forever. Yeah, and this comforter came in the form of this truth. You see, which this is your Yahweh Shah in this present life. You know, he with us through his word. He said, even the spirit of truth, see, whom the world cannot, uh, cannot receive because it seeth him not, neither knoweth him, but ye know him. For he dwelleth with you and shall be with you. I will not leave you comfortless. I will come to you, man. And he came to us by the form of this truth, man. When you heard this truth, it registered with your spirit. That was Yahweh Shah. That was our physician, man. You see? And we need Yahweh Shah here in this lifetime, man. And it's a blessing. Hey, call her Lord Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shah to know the Lord, man. You see? Because, hey, don't nothing in this life amounts up to anything if you don't know Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shah, man. Don't nothing else fucking matter. We in captivity, man. This is the Lord's that we ever been as a nation. Well, we was cut off from our power, man. We operating like niggas, man. We act like niggas. And, and, and Jake love it, man. You see? Hey, we don't know. Hey, our nation, our people don't know how to serve the Lord. You know, this nigga singing. And, and a nigga like that tell you, well, look, King David song to the Lord. You know? Niggas weak, man. Niggas effeminate, emotional, hate hate correction, like like they hair long, you know, just like just pretty much a fucking American, man. 
And that's why the Lord gonna fucking destroy Americans, man. That shit can't, man. That spirit can't abide in the earth. <sighs> you see? Hey, but call all your how about Shimmy I was for this for the physician, man. And the Lord said real quick to go back. He said, when you find them, don't let them go. You know? And it just remind me real quick in the spirit. They remind me of uh, Ecclesiastes 6 and verse um. You see, uh, let's see. Yeah, it kind of six. I'm gonna start at verse uh, verse thirty two, man, because it's truth. It cleans you up in the spirit. Hey, you see, because uh, the so called white man Esau Edom, he done polluted the minds of our nation. Well, uh, yeah, he tell you uh, where's that Isaiah the sixtieth chapter? How gross darkness has covered the people. Yeah, our people are in a state of confusion. They pretty much been, they spiritual antennas been cut off, man. So now they, they cleave to carnality. And carnality leads to death. Because you don't know the ways of your Yahweh, you don't know how to please your power. You're going to do the things that pleases your flesh, man. And Esau, Edom, they set up a society to accommodate the flesh. You know, they keep you far distance from the will of your how about Shema And there's so much convenience here that it would never even cross your mind to even seek a or yeah, to even seek out or serve the Lord, man. Because there's so much convenience here. You know, this is a society that's contrary to the ways of the Lord. You know, but Ecclesiastes 6 and verse 32, he said, My son, if thou wilt, thou shalt be taught. And if thou wilt apply thy mind, thou shalt be prudent. You see, applying your mind to the will of the Heavenly Father. Hey, hey ultimately to this truth. Because it's going to clean you up. It's going to clean all that confusion out of you. And you will be made prudent, wise. You see? In the sights of your how by Shema was shy. It ain't gonna be in the in the in the sights of the uh, of, of the uh, of the world, man. He tell you, he told you in the book of John that when the truth came, the world received them not because it didn't know them, man. The world can't receive this truth. In which is common sense. The world can't receive common sense, man, because everybody in this fucking earth is a fucking fool, man. Because they following after the white man. Esau eat him. You see, but he say, uh, if thou love to hear, thou shalt receive understanding. And if thou bind thy ear, thou shalt be wise, man. You see? Stand in the multitude of the elders and cleave unto him that is wise. Be willing to hear every godly discourse and let not the parables of understanding escape thee. You see? You can't let this truth get away from you, man. This is the good doctrine. When you say forsake ye not my law, man. You can't let this. This is that one thing you can't let get away. Here it is. Jake be chasing E bald head ass all across the city. You just can't let this one go. I can't got to marry this. Hey, be like that with the truth. Be like that with your Howard Shot, man. When you find your Howard Shot, when you him and you cleave to him and don't let him go, man. Through thick and thin, man. You see, because it's gonna come, it's gonna come a lot of obstacles. It's gonna try to shake the faith, man. You see, that's why you should pray for strength. Pray that the Lord strengthen you and give you endurance to endure the uh the process, man. You know, because hey, we say uh, let no man take thy crown. That shows you that it's, it's danger that lies ahead before you can even receive the crown, but it's already set up for you. But you have to go through the dangers, man. And you can't let the parables of understanding escape thee because this is what's going to preserve you. It's going to keep you in your right mind. Everybody else out here sick and lost, man, confused. You see? They don't know the Lord, man. But, man, it's just something quick through the spirit, man. I just saw that fucking video, man. This shit just spark a fire, man. Because Jake threw, man. Jake is confused, man. I don't know how to... What the fuck they think the Lord... What the fuck do these niggas, what, what are they mindset when they come to your how about Shema was shot? Like, like the Lord to be pleased with that, man. Like, what the fuck is that? The Lord love, hey, hey, masculinity, a man's supposed to be manly, man. It ain't supposed to be no form of ma uh, femininity in you. You saying it's high pitched singing and shit, man. With, with your shirt off, man. That shit look off, man. You know, but hey, this America. This where the fuck we living at, man. You know? 
Baby, Lord willing, he was edified to the legacy of those seeking salvation our Lord, Yahweh Shah. As always, giving on the way and praise to Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shah, Bahashim Rahakwadash, Lord Wins in this video. Shalom.